Hello guys and welcome back. I'm Daily Fix and we are going to be starting a new series. Yeah. So Mountain Blade Warband, I was almost about to abandon it. Yeah. There's a lot. That that's not much support, but here we go. We go, are going to be starting with a new mod, Tainted Paths, and Tainted Paths has released mm, somewhere last week. Unfortunately, do work and construction of my house i was not able to get started earlier on now this is the very first time that we are starting this one up for me as well so i'll have the same experiences as you will have when starting in this mod so i could really use all the advice you can give me also there's a small promise here that i'll try to honor for the best of my abilities if this episode or any up uh, episode in the future hits 100 likes, I will do my best to release the next episode ASAP, so as soon as possible. That stated, let's get started on a, a new game, We're selecting a scenario. Now this, this is a cool option. There are three periods you can choose from. Medieval period, and it will have like the known persons from that time. Age of Exploration, changing day to 1573. Um, this will have more pistols. That's William of Orange, yes, the founder of my country. Now the Twisted Era will have three more factions for you to play with. Um, they will pop in and out, but I believe there is above a hundred and... 15 factions for you to enjoy, but we're going to be starting with the medieval period Just so we can see how the game is progressing Now This mod has a lot a lot of factions like I already said, but this mod also is Somewhat the same as Total War. So if you're enjoying Total War, then this might be a mod for you They have at least done a lot of preparation of course, there are always some lesser mistakes, but hey, it's a game. What shall we start with? Shall we start with this one? Fuyiwara, or something like that. Of course, my pronunciation hasn't changed. We're going to be starting as a male with decapitations on. Oh, fluffy kitten. But we're not taking that because it's already occupied. Yes. Wow, that is uh, actually quite a lot. Now, I'm not going to say this is Chinese or Japanese because um, I'm not, <laughs> not... I have no knowledge whatsoever of that. Uh, that. That would be my wife. Now, this does seem somewhat coolish for my starting starting character. Let's start with the name Daily Fix. In the future, if we are going to be having more, more series on this, we might have some background stories. Background stories will always be provided in the Discord community that I am running together with Fastral and Dart Vegan. So be sure to go to the description and join the coalition of gamers on Discord and have fun with all of us. As for stats, let's go strength and agility to 15. Um, we are missing a lot of, lot of skills that you usually see. Now the fun thing that I am noticing is there is a max on certain skills. As you see here, Power Strike has a max of 7. Power Draw max of 7. And I think that is about it. Yeah, those are the only two skills that have a max of 7. The rest of them is 10. Now I'm not good with throwing weapons so we are not going to do that. We've got one in Raiden. I think I want to get a bit more shield and a crap ton of power strike. Let's start off by doing the one handed weapon because I have no clue what I'm getting. Mm, no. Let's uh, use randomize until we see something that is uh, interesting to play with. Yeah. So, my question to you, of course, is, uh, is this a mod that will tickle your interests? Yeah, let's take this one. 
If so, in the description there's a link to the download page on mod DM or mod DB, sorry for that. And um, join me there. Also, if you have advice, knowledge, do let me know. And here we go, this is your story. In the distant past, a neighboring uh, nation declared war on your sovereign state. This war had seen casualties of the majority of your bloodline. Except for your younger sister. Okay, that's cool. Is there something going to be happening with my younger sister? You yourself had enlisted to fight for your sister and your country, leaving her behind in your home village. Okay, that's cool. Okay, uh, interesting start here. Um, good thing, the game is now paused. Yes. Hotkeys. Um, v to activate the command menu. Pressing T will delegate or charge. Left click on the enemy flag to attack them. Right click on the allied flag to back them up. Left click on the map to move. Right click to attack and move. Pressing the dot or comma to encourage your troops. Note, if decapitation are, are enabled, in mod options, harmless script errors may appear when a decapitation occurs. Feel free to disable it in camp. Mod options, if you find it annoying. <laughs> we will see. So, pressing V. Oh, wow. So, this is the charge button then. This is an H, an N. Can I say... Okay, that, that's just... Can I select everyone? Use melee weapons? Fire at will? Huh. Can I select multiple? No, I cannot. And uh, the enemy is really starting to use their flank. Cavalry. Go to the side. Melee. Move forward. Oh my god, they're bobbling. They're bulping. Archers to the back and... We will see if we will um, be able to do this. Bushini, Bushini, Elite. Holy crap, there's a lot of Bushini here. So, V, Cavalry. And we'll probably start flanking them from the right side. There's Cavalry onto the side. Can I tell you to do something else? Like, spread out. No. Okay, just go. Go attack. No? Okay, fine. Have it your way. Cavalry, pressing T. You know what? Everyone, charge! <laughs> we will see how this will turn out. But look at this, man. The Samurai Age. And here I am. These guys are so good equipped. Pressing comma will encourage them. Cavalry is charging in as well. I don't think this will go well for us. But we'll do our best. Of course, like always. Now luckily for me, if you happen, if you happen to be knocked out, then uh, you'll get another unit. Holy crap, look at these samurai swords. That's fantastic. I love that. Okay, I was hoping I would do more damage. There you go, come on. I just want to kill one with my main character. Come on, let me kill one. These guys are so well equipped. Okay, let's press the comma again and get the heck out of here. Unfortunately, I got killed. Oh, wow. No clue where the enemy is, but we'll just start hacking and slashing. And we can still encourage our troops. Now, I don't really think that you are meant to win this. I don't know. We'll see. I, I don't see anything. Wow. I have no clue where my guys are. Okay, there they are. There's some enemies. There's some enemies. Okay. Come on, let me kill one. At least one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Block, block, please. Ah, damn it. I am not doing well. <laughs> Wow. 
I'm, I'm really much... I'm a lot slower than these guys. Oh, we are definitely, definitely not going to win this. The bows are quite slow. But they do a lot of damage. Yeah, we are definitely not winning this. Oh no! No! Go away! Okay, go down fighting! <laughs> go down dying, actually. Yeah, this, this is a, um, a sad way for me to... Uh... Oh, wow. Yeah, oh, definitely not winning this. Um, backspace will also bring you to your command menu by the looks of it. You were defeated. Yes, I know. So, the Great War has finally ended. However, the dead do not come back to life. You return home to swirling ruins. The village has been razed and looted. No trace of your sister. Who knows where she might have gone. It is you against the world. Time passes, you look around. Now, there is some interesting options, actually. Uh, the Monarch, the Dodge or Vassal. Recommended to new players. You will start with a with one castle, heavy armor. Uh, we got some maintained troops, for free. Honor increases by one per week. We got a bandit. Rewards are doubled for occasional quests. Nay, controversial. Controversial, wow, what a word. Looting traders. We got a pirate, of course, they're pirates. But I think we'll go with the um, with the vessel start. Uh, we're not going to be starting as a monarch, and I think I do want to start as a loyal vessel this time. Uh, you're an the thieves, the oppressor, living a life as a noble groomed to inherit. You manage to pick a thing or two while studying and observing military functions. Let's start off as a loyal vessel. And there is a lot of information here. Really a lot. Wow. Okay. Well, I'm not going to be reading that for now. So, here we go. We got our nice looking castle. Uh, are we at war with anyone at the moment? Oh, look at this. Notes is completely gone. So, my camp. Uh, we can manage trips. What does it do? Okay, that's uh, quite cool. Uh, mod options. Abandon everything. Disable equipment drops dropping during battle. Uh, reinforcement wave. Reinforcement. A lot of options here. Now, I believe there is an option for you that you can set some of the AI to do all those things. Uh, lands breaking uh, may cause crashes. Now, I do not like crashes, so I'm not going to be enabling that. Uh, troop spawns. This feature is very buggy, so we might want to avoid fighting during the night. Add me to Snapchat. Uh, no. Enable hardcore mode, extended camera. Horn sound when commanding troops. No, because, well, actually, let's leave it on until we say, man, these horns are annoying. Page two, minimum damage. Well, enable AI kicking. Can the AI kick? No, only I can kick. Notes, hotkeys, cheat, menu. I don't have that enabled, that's weird. Talk with companion, I don't have those. Uh, reports, player information. Oh wow, this armor looks already fantastic. We'll have a look at that. Um, adventure traits. Oh, that is quite cool. I like that. Politic traits. Oh man, this is a this is going to be very, very complicated as a mod, isn't it? 
Oh wow, leather gloves of 25-25-25. Head armor? I, I could wear my gloves as a hat, they would do a lot better I think. I got a cool ass armor, I got a horse, I got a katana. I got no money. Oh that's cool. Character? Nothing changed, no more skills, my strength has been upped to 28. Okay, well fine, I can do that. Troops. Let's upgrade those if I am able to. Although I don't have the money for it. So these are veterans. I already have a few veterans here. Let's do a few more. And some calf. I also have a army of 5,000. Oh, that's cool. Okay, let's get in here. So, you are always roaming the towns looking for your last family member. You are searching the country of your birth. Tavern keepers often find valuable information. Let me enter. Okay, this is a lot different. <laughs> Optimization is off. I could turn it on. Automatically developers started. Increased construction cost will double. Okay, let's not. Let's wait until we got some more money. We got 13,000 defenders, a food output of 20. This is actually quite quite cool relationship there is a street a public bath a fighting pit a tavern duelist duelist if you win i will pay you 5000 dinar okay let's let's start with a duel then just uh, could you die and give me the money please Oh, this is actually quite good to improve your weapon skill. Come on, just die already. You're bleeding all over the floor. Stop that. Okay, just back up. Get momentum back. This is not getting momentum back. And we won. Now give me my money. You promised. Holy crap. We got some money here. That's cool. My money is 17,000. Got some experience. Got some more honor. Uh, Gilmore, excellent work. Here's your reward. Um, up, up to level 5, huh? The duelist is gone. So, what I think is, if you go to a town, pure speculation, and there are things that are yellow, click those. So, save. Game successfully saved. Did it actually save? Because there is a lot of information going all over the place. There you go. It indeed saved. That is quite good to know. Actually, quite fun actually. Yeah. Um, stationed. Recruits. Training. If you don't know where to go on the main quest, enter the camp menu in the bottom left corner of the map. Main quest tip. Wait a minute, if you don't know where to go, go to the main, um, in the main quest, enter the camp menu, and select, okay, that's cool. Okay, what will happen? My army size is the same, morale is somewhat increasing, that's cool. I could recruit. I don't know if I really need to recruit right now. Noble mansion, arena, fighting pit, market, trade post, structures and equipment. Let's go to the tavern. Um, ransom broker, a traveler, a wandering bard, a veteran dude with a stick. Ah, uh, good day, sir. How may I help you? I'm your lord. Address me like it. Hmm. Hey, I know you. You live next door to us. Oh, dang. Oh, my God. I never thought I'd see you again. Yay. I came back. Our village has been destroyed. There was nobody about. When all the young men left the village, our people was imprisoned by slave traders. They were waiting for a chance. We were sold to the enemy, including your sister. What? No. Um, they usually sold slaves to town in to the town of Terra. So we need to go to um, Tyra. Perhaps it is unspeakable, and unspeakable is dangerous to you. You should be talking with lords of your country. 
to the lord of your country, he will help you. Right, this job is in need of assistance of an army, and I have none of them. So, the tavern is now open, so if I go there... No, there's no lord here. You know what, I'll drag this episode out quite a bit more. Fighting pit market. Library, bookshop, academy, street, public bath. Guidance, guidance! Okay, oh wait, there's a lot of guidance here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sounds amazing, let's exit. So, I think this might be the capital though. If you don't know where to go, yes, thank you for your MLG and pro tip there. Is this um, the Lord's faction? Well, you are most likely his wife. Okay, well, she doesn't want to tell us anything. A traveler, a ransom broker again. Uh, do you have a job for me? There's something I could help you with. An issue with a lawless villain. He murdered one of my innocent men. Or oh, one of the innocent. The bounty is two and a half thousand dinars. Okay. Okay. I will hunt him. Fine. Um, it's safe. Uh, camp. And there should be a main quest tip. Oh, wow. So, it does feel there is a massive story going on. Um, but, if I press quest, not much has changed. That's a bit of a shame. Also, then I don't know where to go. Perhaps it's just in here. Nope. Not in here. Okay, fine. Fine. Uh, by the way, we might want to stock up on food. Market? There is no food. Trade post? Nothing. I love games where there's no food. You know, it saves me uh, so much. There's some bandits here that I would like to attack. There's some more over there. 116. Could you come back, please? No? Fine. Let's go to the uh, the outlaws. Speed up a bit. Hopefully they... They can walk over water. But we've made it. Prepare to die. Oh, that's cool. Weather is clean, begin the battle. Bandit leader has these guys. Hell yeah, let's go. So, by pressing V again. There is M, J and... What does J do? Hold fire. Fire at will. Decapitation occurred. Okay, um, let's select... Could you go in? Are you going in? Yes, they are! Cavalry, go in. And you are holding. That's quite fun, actually. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we can kill a few. Um, the looters are actually doing a lot of damage to us. Then again, we are just charging in. Um, can I tell my archers? Oh, it's really getting used to this menu. And selecting these guys up there. Let's uh, see if the archer... Okay, um, let's go in here. Oh, that I didn't know. Oh, very slow swing. Uh, at least I'm killing quite a few though. But it's a really slow skin. That reminds me, let's level up a bit. Because that is way, way, way too slow. Um, 30 would be the max, right? For us right now. So let's do some more in agility. Proficiency would be very nice. Shield is already 6. Riding. Let's increase some of our... Iron Flash, and we need more in two-handed weapons. 
We need actually we we need a crap ton of it because uh, we are really really way 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 too slow. Will this change anything? Oh the hell you don't. We are not doing that, sir. So we'll probably be reinforced rather soon. Uh, my style of commanding really is not the best, as you can see. Oh wow, they all have javelins. I hate javelins. Um, wow, uh, no! <laughs> everyone charge! Just charge! Uh, everyone, go! Yeah. Please! Save me! Okay, my horse is really out, is getting it. We are getting to be this mountain. Come on. Because this, this is not... Oh, wow. You bastard. What did that horse do to you? Oh, decapitation. I'm not getting much damage. Therefore, that I'm grateful. Um, what I think is um, the following. You will get reinforced. But it's probably not during the fight. Uh, luckily, this character is completely beefed. So, they are really carrying me. They are really carrying me. <laughs> it's incredible. Proficiency-wise, it's really going up. That's quite nice. Victory, yes. So, the, vic the, the, the result was a victory. Select your bounty. A masterwork javelin. A X, a spike club. Well, I don't know what, what about you. I don't really like the javelins. I'll go for the X mainly because it is the most expensive thing. Select your additional reward. Battle experience, advanced experience or honor. I think I want to go for honor. I don't know if it's uh, the right thing. Some troops are ready to be upgraded. That's uh, quite nice. Let's uh, level them all up. Because they are really going to be helping me a lot. There's a limitation on tier 6 units. Okay, that's good to know. And of course, we leveled up as well. Now, is this... No, it isn't. Let's go back to our own town. And we now have a axe. Awesome. We might find a companion eventually. Uh, but I think that is more something for the next episode. Now, of course, you all have your ideas. You all have your feedback. And I'm absolutely dying to know what would be the best course of action for tactics. As you know, I'm probably not the most fit person for that. And you guys have all the information. But this is already maxed out. Let's keep that maxed as well. So, guys, as for now, thank you so, so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. If you did, then uh, don't forget to hit that like button for the next episode at 100 likes to be released as soon as physically possible. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.